<laughs> ah, you're surprisingly lively for having been dead for 30 years. <laughs> The giggles, they will serve you well. <laughs> Since you have been rotting for so long, in case you have forgotten, I am Werner Herzog, <laughs> renowned filmmaker and taskmaster. <laughs> We're here today because you are what's left of the brain of Orson Welles. <laughs> Him being better than the sum of all of us in our parts. <laughs> Shot into the infinity of space. Exploded into a supernova. Formed into a new earth. Breeding a lovely, glorious civilization that is then destroyed by a sun exploding. But they managed to shoot off one survivor. And he comes to Earth and his name is Superman. <laughs> <laughs> so you can see what I personally think of Orson Welles. Great guy. <laughs> There's something locked in your little brain cells. Little brain. It's the last bit of his script that he never got to finish, and we're going to scoop it out like warm, semi-appealing ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> Lars? Yeah. Oh, yeah. The typewriter. Oh, oh no, it appears to be stuck in the entrance of a space pod. Let oh. me go get it. You didn't adequately clear out the eye socket. Oh, sorry. All right. Oh, that's not a good start. Oh, no, it's not. Why don't you introduce yourself? Oh, yeah. Hi, I'm, I'm Lars von Trier, a renowned Great Dane dish man. Uh, you know, uh, He's like Hamlet with Penises. Yeah. <laughs> to penis or not to penis? I came up with that. We're all so proud of you. Now I'm depressed. <laughs> I'm happy again. Let's do this. About right. Um, where did our little intro astronaut go? Oh, Klaus. Klaus. <laughs> we have snacks. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh no, no, Klaus, come into the space Klaus. car. <laughs> <laughs> it's just rotting brain, don't worry. <laughs> I'm just making some news about Klaus. Okay. <laughs> the only kid free for the job. Or jog. Oh. I might have written jog. That works. <laughs> All right, so if I understand the plan correctly, we're sending Klaus into the brain out of the safety of the space pod, brain pod, inner pod. Don't make it sound so daunting. Oh, okay, don't worry. You might not come back, but know this, Klaus. You were hated. We've got any protective equipment, Klaus. Are you ready? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, it's gonna fit. Ah, there we go. Hey, look, the ever responsible Lars will have a hold on you the entire time. Don't worry, you're not going anywhere. Yes, yes. Oh, my hold in the bucket. Yes. If you make a fist, it won't fit. <laughs> ah. It's like making love to an inflatable device. I've been made party to something that I don't like. Yes, you need to Velcro, see? That will protect you from whatever comes from a corpse. <laughs> Gases and bacteria and I don't know. Raccoon. <laughs> <laughs> Feel 
ready? Can I have a high five? Limp, but enthused. <laughs> There's the defecation bucket, that's what it's for, right? But remember, Klaus, do you remember what we talked about? <laughs> Yes. This is how you will prompt the synapse for a response. <laughs> you have to say it. You can't just read it in your head. <laughs> what is the best kind of fairy tale? Okay, well now you've ruined that one. <laughs> your commitment is always 130%. <laughs> I appreciate every percent of it. You ready? Ready to go? Catch is over there. Let's go through the first airlock. <laughs> that was in case you don't come back. Close it, please. Klaus, <laughs> how does it smell? I'm really curious. It smells like the brain of a genius. Mm, like marshmallows. <laughs> Oops, you've lost your keys. Keys! Where is it? Keys! <laughs> okay. Well, I think I did that one wrong. I think I did that You never keep your Bernie Sanders <laughs> in your anal pockets, in your inner pockets, in your inner pockets, <laughs> or your anal pockets. That does qualify. <laughs> Ballard! Ballard! 
Conversation you're having. Yes, on that subject, I have asked you to stop, stop drilling peepholes into my house oh. and into my rooms. It's most disconcerting, and I will not accept any of your numerous invitations that you slip into my pillow and my mouth. Oh. <laughs> but on that subject, I was attempting a station the other day. <laughs> When I when I had produced children from out of my uterus, uh, 
it was a most mystical experience. I fed them my tears, but no tears came from my breast, and so I felt that I owed the world uh, some type of substance. And so I think for my next project at the MoMA, I may, I may lactate into a cube. <laughs> yeah! Where'd you get those great scarves? <laughs> From the uh, Great Scarf Shore uh, Shop. Great Scarf Shore Stop! <laughs> no, that's Great Scarf Shore Stop! Great Scarf Short Stop. Yeah! That all came from one piece of paper. <laughs> great Shop She says Great Shop Bus Stop. Oh, I say Great Dust Bar Stop. <laughs> What do you say, bugle man? <laughs> Race for butt plug! Oh, my favorite! <laughs> that one's more my style. <laughs> How's it coming here, Werner? It's happening. It's happening. Okay, I don't want to rush to I'm sorry, is this too long? No. I didn't take two years to write Nymphomaniac. I was sober! <laughs> <laughs> Don't run away, Klaus! I have you in my iron grip! Lies! Klaus! Who would win in a fight? Monk or monkey? <laughs> oh, shit! Human being! That's not one of the fucking answers, Lars! Don't make me come out there! I dare you, Lars! Oh, that's it! <laughs> no, Lars, don't! You've got the only rope! <laughs> well, you know what? It's happening! I'm not as disappointed by this as I should be. Yeah. <laughs> this wonderful umbilical cord reminds me of, of my backyard. I have several umbilical cords. I can plug myself into nature at any moment. It's Who's holding you alive? <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> We're floating into the depths of Orson Welles' brain! Who knows where we'll end up? <laughs> I press myself into the grass and I feel its pain. It cries out to me constantly. Is it crying because you're crushing it? <laughs> Sound guy! What is the best kind of butt sex? Uh, gentle? Gentle! <laughs> That's a smart answer when you don't know who you're dealing with. <laughs> I've got something very similar to this in Vogue. Hey, Bernard! Bernard! You're not dead yet? <laughs> no. I mean, good. But I appear to be lost somewhere between the clavicle and the <coughs> clavicle. Um, yeah, just follow the feeling of shame <laughs> that sort of pinches you in the back of your brain, knowing how others judge you every time you go outside. <laughs> that will lead you to me. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Tilda, can you let me in? Will you stop putting webcams in my bedroom? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> so we'll do something with this. Oh! But centric as it is. Yeah! <laughs> 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 Did I hear butt centric? Oh! Is that the voice of world renowned patron saint David Lynch? <laughs> <laughs> I murder. 
Hi, David! Oh, wow. I can't believe someone's coming to, to visit me in Orson Welles' brain. <laughs> David, how long have you been here? Oh, about a year or so. Oh, my. But time moves much slower in Orson Welles' brain. That's not surprising, considering the runtime of Citizen Kane. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe just feels that way because everything's been dead and dying, but also amplified by genius at the same time. God damn it, why can't I say things like you, David? <laughs> David, I've missed you terribly. I felt a vibration the other day. You would have loved it. Well, you're all here. Ah. Yes, we don't seem to be able to separate. Just <laughs> like purgatory. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. Who built this spaceship? <laughs> oh, I don't. I didn't check on that part. I just found it. I built it with my mind. Oh, Lars, you're so funny. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Would you do us a favor? I'm okay. I've shoddily constructed a script out of what we possibly <laughs> poked. Out of Orson Welles' brain. No way! He might have had some interesting weekends. <laughs> <laughs> I've been trying to talk to Orson Welles' brain for the past six months. Have you tried poking it? I have not. It works wonders. I tried electrifying it, staring at it with the magnifying glass, telling it riddles, but nothing worked. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, you need direct questions. It likes being questions, doesn't it? <laughs> so you have a script, huh? Oh, I'm a. I'm That's a what we're calling it. <laughs> Ooh. Yes. My association with it should end were anyone to not like it. Are you sure of? Thank you, Ben Davis. <laughs> It looks like there's a character named Buttocks in this script. <laughs> that is accurate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, wait a minute. You know what? I do this a lot, so I should be fine. I mean, um, how great would it be to have one of Orson Welles' brain synapses actually be part of the script? Oh! Unless, unless uh, you think one of you David did it. David did it again, and now I look stupid. Oh, wow! <laughs> I mean, unless... Unless, you know, one of you could be buttocks. But you, perhaps one of you wants to be buttocks. We probably should get buttocks really quick. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, this Klaus, one seems a little lively. Klaus can play himself. Yeah, let's, let's buttocks super quick. Okay. Uh, okay. Open up Klaus, the you're in the script. Go read it. I think it's that way. Okay. I think it's worth Oh, hi! Hi! Hello. <laughs> My name is Buttocks. Yeah. Hi, I'm Werner. This is Klaus. That's Bugles. <laughs> hey, I'm to meet you. You have twice as many teeth as you know about. <laughs> <laughs> That's about as close to a hello as she gets. <laughs> all right, hey, David, well, do your magic. Let's. We all have to gather around the script. Come on, let's gather around the script because we only have one script. Ah, oh, yeah. Okay, and. Oh. Now there's Klaus, <laughs> there's buttocks, your buttocks, and man, Tilda. <laughs> Please, allow me to be the man. Of course. <laughs> All right. I'm going to just read the parts, and when I point to you, that's when you just do whatever comes out of the genius portion that you are, and Tilda... Just be yourself. The only Kinski for... Oh, that's notes I was making earlier. Go down to the scene that opens. <laughs> yes, the scene opens. Oh, whoa, is the buttocks. It opens on a... Here, sorry, just let me... I'm really right. good with narration. Give me a second. The scene opens on a pocket close-up of a man's buttocks, it is firm with grief. So <laughs> oh, well is the buttocks. <laughs> yes, Arka. I am much with grief. I have seen the void, and it is an anus. <laughs> man. That's what I wrote down. <laughs> Turn around. <laughs> Becoming man. Who's that? <laughs> Oh, 
dear, the comet on which I find myself speaks. I am in a well of despair, for I know we rocket toward nothing. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> now think of the well and the comet. God, your, your actor uh, has left. <laughs> oh. Klaus, you're not done. <laughs> You have a named part. You play yourself. You play yourself as Jesus. It's your favorite. Uh, are you insulting me? Well, that's the script. That was the script. How can I insult that which has no soul? You're simply my planet, my voyage. Oh, ah, I'm having a border for Orson Welles' genius right now. I'm like, going to sit down now! <laughs> no, don't! The darkness. Okay, direction. Darkness comes through the void. You collapse. And Matt, you yes. brought it. Become the darkness. Let's hey, hey, run through the rest okay. real speedy. Let's like. just <laughs> do your Jesus bit. Really yeah, quick Klaus, now. Klaus Kinski enters. Fuckers, get out of my bed, fuckers! Who are you fucking? You are not worthy! This is my dream, my fucking dream! Hey, we did it! <laughs> but is lying now. The Messiah! The book tells me of your coming. Oh, yes. Someone to quell the evil one, the yes. planet of doom. Yes. <laughs> this is all very aggressive. <laughs> Think of the S in aggressive. We are, we are almost a done, right? It, it should be. It is much. the word of anal god. Rectophilus. Rectophilus? Rectophilus. <laughs> he then. Klaus has one more line in the front. Ah, yeah. 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 I will not take this insubordination. I am Jesus! I am Jesus! Yeah! We did it! We have exactly eight seconds before we are full size again. Okay. All right. <laughs> Bye. Thank you. Thank you for joining us. Can I get your right back with you? David, what a stupid question. Of course you can. You can't. You stay here. <laughs> <laughs>